Okay, we've got to set some Venn diagrams question here. Now, here's the information we need, okay? And what this is saying is that within the rectangle, there are 50 items, all right? And there's N, uh, that's the number of items within the rectangle of 50. Number of items in A intersection B is 4, so I can straight away do that, all right? The number of items in A altogether is five, so I've already got four, so that's got to be one. And the number of items in B altogether is nine, so that has to be five. And the whole lot's got to add to 50, so this has to be 40. All right, pretty straightforward for two marks. Now then, find um, the number of items in A union, not B. Now, how I do this is by doing a little sketch. Here we go, and... All right, so I'm going to colour in um, A. So A is this here. All right, now I'm going to colour in not B. Now I'll do it in a different colour. So not B is there. All right, there. Now, because it's got this symbol here, I want all the areas where there's two types of, both types of shading. And that is in this bit here. Okay, so therefore my answer to that one is 1. I'm going to do a similar thing for the next one. So number of items in uh, A, not B. So let's do A. And actually, it's exactly the same shading, isn't it? So there you go. And this time we're going to get uh, not B. So here we go. Notice I'm doing it a different way. If you haven't got a different coloured pen or pencil in the exam then you'll have to do that now because it's this symbol this time okay we've got to use anything that has some shading so uh, the only thing that isn't there is this bit okay so therefore that's five so my answer is going to be 45 because there's 45 other bits there so i think it's quite a nice way of doing it with the shading uh, for these bottom two bits but yeah Ultimately, you've got to learn what these symbols mean.